I'm a scaredy boy. I'm scared. What's up, guys? Welcome to No Post Podcast. It's your boy, uh, the Gyno over here. It's uh, Armageddon right here, over here. I'll be over here. <laughs> over here? Where? Over here, fucking. Sound up! Next to that sound. That doesn't make sense, but anyway. Why next. I don't know. This opening goes hey, ghost. somewhere. But hey, this ghost. Hey, ghost. Oh, hold on, ghost. I'm going <laughs> to say... Wait, turn the light off? I'm going to say sound off, and then you're going to say your name in like a really peppy way. Preppy? Peppy. Peppy? Peppy. Like preppy. Cheerleader. Like peppy or preppy, you know, like peppy, like with the good like energy, like pepper, like, like oh pepper. hi, hey, welcome, like welcome pe- to McDonald's, like Pepe, like that lady, <laughs> like the lady that who served us, the, the lady who served us when we ordered like fucking potato like, uh, skins. <laughs> She's like, oh, all right, cool, potato skins. <laughs> Did you notice that how she was? Yeah, yeah, I thought she was gonna give me a high five. <laughs> all right, sound off. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is MTF, better known as Mito Crimson Fate or Midori. Or King Baby, go. Baby. King Baby. King Baby. Because I'm the king, baby. <laughs> yeah, oh my god. <sighs> okay. All right. Y'all hate me. All right, what do you got for us, Armageddon? Um, arm, arm person? He's a news Let's anchor. see. I'm sticking my hand in the hat of his arms. I just pic- pictured him You're big old arms. And, and I'm pulling out Rabbi sucking baby dick. Okay, they're not really it's, sucking uh, This it. is nothing. This is We're not being pedophiles. This is not... You know, I have no idea what that even well, is. Well, just explain. How about you just explain? Well, right it's away. gonna be a shitty like <laughs> explanation of what I know, but I guess since the Jewish tr- tradition still practices circumcisions on uh, infant male boys, <laughs> whenever the rabbi is done doing that procedure, he uh, he begins by uh, well, afterwards he sucks the baby's dick. That's I don't not... know if he. I don't know if he's. I don't because I'm barely learning about it. So I don't know if he if he sucks the dick. You're learning like about he it. Performs what is it? Fellatio. Or oral no, sex? he doesn't suck it off. I don't know if he sucks it or he just stops the blood. I don't know. if yeah, he, has he peroxide sucks the blood in his mouth. Like he fills his mouth with alcohol peroxide or some sort of. Like, <laughs> and he has a bandaid in yeah. his tongue. Or some shit. Yeah, yeah, like he wraps a bandaid. It's really with his, nasty. No, really. Maybe his dick with his like tongue a or something. To live longer. No, it, it's literally it's, it's a part of their tradition though. That's why they do it. Yeah, they cut it and then he sucks the blood out of like the foreskin or whatever. He sucks the blood and then uh. What what I heard is that the little babies they get like herpes from it too, cause of, like the guy's mouth. You yeah, heard that too, right? Dude. And sometimes they die. Pretty crazy. A lot of them. Turns out Jews. T- yeah, the Nazis yeah. really did a number on them. Yeah. The Jews are kind of weird. Fuck yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it's so weird. It's like the. F- and, and what's so weird about it is that it's still continuing to this day. Yeah, in 2018. Yeah, it's something that's still happening. I want. I want to see that. That's cool. It's like you f- want to see it. Yeah, I want to see it. It's in front yeah, of like a whole it. audience. It's on YouTube. Really? Yeah. Literally. Whoa. And it's it's not even like you know how they have censored? those little censored or anything, or they well, have it like flagged or they have it's you like, like a, it's a medical thing now. Yeah. Well, that's why. Man, that's... Yo, it's a fucking retarded thing to do. It's, Maybe it's in America, pedoph- but not to them. What do you? Oh yeah, not to them, of course, because they're retarded. A retarded person is <laughs> not aware yeah. of how retarded they but are. But don't they or make... that they're currently in a retarded state? Don't they do? Don't <laughs> Jews usually do pretty well for themselves? Like I said, the same thing about people that eat ass. I mean, that's retarded. You're eating. That's a ritual. Too. Yeah, but it's how can you compare eating <laughs> ass to is a that your, is that your ritual? <laughs> or like, a grown it's man. It's both retarded. Yeah, it's not retarded because if one person's consenting to wanting to get their assy and the other one's into it, and they're two consenting adults, how is that retarded? <laughs> you're still and they're, retarded. They're exploring each other's bodies, and they're yeah, you're still and, retarded. How's that retarded? That's retarded. You're gonna how? eat where shit came from. That's but if it's clean, that's retarded. As that's shit, okay. Dude. And piss comes out of dicks. Yeah. And discharge comes out of vaginas, and people still eat that. Yeah, but it's not shit. But I don't understand the difference. They're both discharged. It's both well, waste. No, no, but here's the thing. Have you ever, like, pee? You ever heard, like, pee sterile? You ever hear shit sterile? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah, that shit sterile. True. Is it? Unless shit yeah. is sterile. I don't know. Let's try to find out. Yeah. What does that even That's mean, pee, pee being sterile? Does that mean I could, like, put, put it on my cuts or something? What does that mean? My grandpa does that. He puts pee on his but I wouldn't. No. I wouldn't do it too often because he got his finger cut off. So he got his finger cut off. Yeah. What happened? He was diabetic. Didn't take care of himself. Oh, you made it seem like something. He but I mean, did he something. did pee on his hands all the time. So is he the one he drives the truck around? Yeah, That's the same one. I haven't seen him in a while. Really? Yeah. Why? Let's get into that. Oh, ever since I went to Nam, man, I haven't been the same. Oh, you went to Nam. So, man, how old is your grandpa then? <laughs> if you went to Nam, <laughs> <laughs> is, is your grandpa Larry <laughs> King or something? He's 176. Holy. This is April. Holy. How do you manage to live so long? I don't know. Probably Being like on his hands. hands. <laughs> Being <laughs> on his hands. Drinking his own piss. At first, I used to think he was an alcoholic. Then I realized he's probably peeing in that bottle. <laughs> uh, have you guys ever peed in a bottle? 
plenty of times. I've, yeah. 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 yeah I, I was surprised so. that my bladder held. It almost like I think I filled up a whole yeah. bottle oh, before. Oh my bottle, yeah. god! There's this one time. It was recent. Oh, this last soccer game I went to. <laughs> you peed in the I bottle. Had, no, I had to pee so bad, but I was like, um, you know, it's uh, the park or whatever is in downtown. Mm -hmm. So I was gonna. I was walking towards where I was gonna get picked up, and it's by the courthouse, and there's like bushes. I was. I was ready to pee right there. I was like, man, I'm just gonna like go behind one of these bushes, like. Cop shouldn't be able to like see me. I'm just gonna pee right there. At the courthouse. And then uh cop popped out of the bush. <laughs> <laughs> no. So my ride my ride came. So I was like, man, I'm just gonna go pee at home. I'd rather just pee at home. Mm -hmm. And that whole ride, I was just like, you know, trying to just focus, like, I'm just gonna get home. Had a piece just so so bad and I, I was just focusing focusing and we finally got home i never had this feeling but like i could feel like my bladder it was just like a ball inside my body mm -hmm. it felt so nasty dude and any movement like so when as soon as i tried to get up out of the car it felt like i was just, like i was either gonna rupture my bladder like it was just gonna pop inside of me oh yeah or like i was gonna feeling. be dude like at that moment i'm like i'm either gonna go to the hospital right now because <laughs> it's gonna pop and I should have not done this, or like I'm just gonna pee myself. But did you let the people know in the car that you had to go, or you just yeah, kept it to yourself? Yeah, yeah, no, they're trying to hurry up. Uh, um, hitting all the speed stop bumps. Somewhere. Stop yeah. somewhere? Yeah. I, I didn't want to. <laughs> I, was, I was trying to get <laughs> home. To or just climb in, the, climb in the trunk with the bottle. Or something. Well, cause like when we were driving. I, you know, I felt like I was in control, even though I had to go pee really, really bad. And Did it you was start sweating? I, part, probably. Oh, uh, I, I remember sweating. But it was until that moment when I actually tried moving out, like, of the vehicle. Oh, oh it yeah. felt... I never, ever felt something like that. Like, I can feel it inside. It was just, like, a big ball. Mm -hmm. It just... What were you uh, drinking? Big ball piss. <laughs> Beer. Beer? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, I had a... Uh, it was a big salt ball. That's, like, the worst type of liquid to hold in when you have to piss. But it's crazy because so over fun. at the game, I, I like, I pissed twice. I only, I only had like... 15 beers. <laughs> no, I only had, I had three beers. Two, it was like two or three bombers. I think it was like two bombers. Bombers? What yeah, 24 bombers? ounce. Like the jacket? 24 ounce can. Oh. Uh, you call them bomber? Yeah, they're called bombers. I've never heard that before. Where are you from? That sounds like a terrorist term. Where are you from? What time zone are you in? Why do you have a Why beer? Why are you a like ghost? This? What the hell? Who am I even talking about? <laughs> Why are you yeah. a ghost? This is all making sense now. Where'd you hear that from? Because of the bombers? <laughs> <laughs> no wonder he's a ghost. He was a, he was so a terrorist. So your bladder blew you up? <laughs> huh? Your hey, bladder blew you up? Soda. It was supposed to be the vest. Where he is actually from? Bladder yeah. that blew you up. My bladder blew up, and then that's how I became a ghost. <laughs> yeah, anyways, that's a horrible feeling. Don't hold in your piss for that long. <laughs> I know that Not feeling... Bad. What are you going to say? You're probably going to yeah. die. <laughs> What's yeah. more horrible, to holding your piss or your shit? That's what I was about to uh, talk about. Yeah. Huh? Hell yeah, that's way worse. The repercussions are way worse. I'd rather piss myself than shit myself. <laughs> I don't think, anything. but I don't think you can hold in your crap like how I hold, hold, oh. held yeah, in can. my piss. Yeah, you can. Yeah, I've done you it. can. Dude. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. Huh? To, I've held my shit for a mile. Walking. <laughs> it feels like your rectum's gonna blow up inside of you instead of you finally just having to let it out. I feel it like hurts. I feel like the end state is you're gonna crap yourself. Yeah, like your but body. Peeing, the peeing thing is the same thing. You're just gonna pee. No, yourself. dude, I swear that thing would have popped. Like. I think it was <laughs> yeah, it would have popped and you would have peed. You know what the best part Yeah, but my bladder would have popped and you couldn't die from that. Uh, you know it that poisons for your body. Yeah, because uh, when cause my dad, he fell off a cliff when he was younger. <laughs> no, dude. I already <laughs> love <did>. this story. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, I can't remember. I don't remember everything that happened, but it's like uh, over there in Mexico, whatever. It's like this area. You should think of like Yosemite or something, you know, it's just like a place where people go mm -hmm. it has like steep steep cliffs and i don't know what happened but he fell and like he almost died from it um but take he back got... what i said huh? take back what i said about loving the story <laughs> oh, <dude. laughs> nah, go ahead. oh yeah yeah he almost died from it but anyways like uh pretty much like his organs got ruptured and cut and stuff and um oh. i can't remember if his bladder actually got punctured like cut or it, it they said like he was lucky that it almost it didn't i forgot what mm -hmm. um but that's how i know because i guess the doctors were saying like uh like if urine gets into your system it's it's just po it's poison pretty much you'll, you'll just pretty much it's die so from sterile. it because it's, yeah. it's sterile yeah it cleans you completely. i don't know what that means well, sterile sterile is like it doesn't have uh like bacteria or something but that it good? doesn't mean it's not poisonous uh, so you can can you drink your urine i don't know why i'm asking I, you guys I like purify you guys it, I, guess. I heard you could drink it once you can't so you purify it you run it through like a, a, like a shirt right? or something huh? you run it through a rag like your whole life like, <laughs> sort no, of like, like weaking basket that doesn't it. it's not gonna help so often so well i forgot where i heard this one i might be wrong about it I mean, if you boil the dirtiest fucking water you can drink that i'm pretty sure you can boil piss 
Why is it what? so hard to purify salt water? Like, it's like the hardest, like, you can't get hey, let me, it done. Let me say what I was going to say. Oh, what were you saying? <laughs> well, from what I heard, you can piss once, and that piss that you pissed out, you can drink it, but, like, if you drink it, when you piss out again, like, you, you can't drink it. It's too uh, toxic at that point. Whoa, that sucks. You need that? Where'd you learn that from? Medical bear school? Girls. Medical school? Oh, maybe oh, that's dude, where it was you went from. to medical school, dude. Maybe it was Bear Girls. Yeah. I don't bear know. Girls, maybe. Sounds like that's where I would have heard it from. Didn't you go to, like, uh, <laughs> weren't you going to be, like, um... Remember, I was Dr. Bitch before. Oh, I yeah. On I was talking about real life. <laughs> you worked on penises? Now I Were you a rabbi? Were well, you a rabbi? Sucking I'm little a blood. doctor now. Sucking blood out of little dicks. It's like you do. No. Fucking pedophile know. vampire. <laughs> Defending that shit so hard. You can tell it's my Jewish counterparts. <clears throat> Alright, um... Wait, hold on. To answer your question, I think, uh... Wait, what was the question? Uh, it says, I, does it hurt more to hold in a piss or a shit? Oh. Right? Oh, yeah. damn. Shit yeah, that was a way. But, you know what's cool? Like, when you get home... <clears throat> that wasn't the question. Well, anyways... You know what's the best feeling when you, like, when you get home, holding it all day, and as soon as you reach your bathroom and your pants come off, it's like already sliding right out because you're on the toilet. It's like, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? It's that like, happened to me. It's like an automatic eject button. That, that, that's, that's the <laughs> best thing ever, you know? That happens yeah. about five times a week for me. Like, it's all one motion. As soon as yeah. you pull down, it's yeah, coming it's out, there, and, yeah. it's, you la and your ass is hitting the toilet. Yeah. <laughs> And I noticed the longer That's I hold perfect. my shit in, it loses shape. Like, it loses its form. Like, it's not it's not a normal, long, tubular, like, brown log. I get like it'll, it'll, like, it'll get cut up. It'll become, like, raisin bran. Like, super chunky. <laughs> it's it's more satisfying, honestly. Yeah. You, you, in a way, you kind of want to hold your piss and, and your shit for a little while, just so you can it can be, a, like, oh, a bigger that release, relief for you. Yeah. But it's not good. I wish when I shit, Definitely it looked like an actual log. Like, it looked really cool, like Lincoln Logs. And then you know, <laughs> That would be so satisfying. I would want to shit all the time. But just perfect, pristine logs. That How many get. times a day do you guys shit? I wouldn't want to flush it. I shit about three or four times a day. Uh, probably like twice a day. Probably two, three on average. Probably like twice. I used to not really crap at all. Probably like once, <laughs> if that. But I think uh, my diet, once my diet changes and stuff, crap like twice, I think. Yeah. And if you work out a lot... Man, you shit like uh, three, four times. Yeah, I shit back to back sometimes. Like, the heck? You go like, back. I'll, I, like I feel, I'm on somebody, the toilet and, and I'm back. And your, your back's against another guy's back. That's what I was thinking. Yeah. You go back to back with some guy. <laughs> you guys like hold hands and like cross white. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> Me and my girl. Shit's in between my legs. Hey, we shit at the same time. Ghost, uh, you said something about power shitting earlier. Oh, before. Um, so it's pretty much. It just means you can like crap like automatically because I know there's a lot of people that have to sit on the toilet. They kind of you know got to wait. Oh yeah, no. Slowly I, I let it away. come. I just I can go in like I can be in and out of the restroom just like I yeah. piss. Just that's power shitting to you. I thought yeah. Power shitting was like you raise your power level. Power shitting. No. I thought it was shitting when you don't have to. Like you're just like I'm gonna sit down and then you end up shitting. Like you for you will it. No. You force it. That's force shitting. Okay, <laughs> shit, you're right. You will whip your uh, like that. You're That's the, jet, the Jedi. I was concentrating for like a week and a half one time, and I tried to make myself shit, and it hurt so bad. There's I no. Is there any technique to power shitting, or is it just like a a, a brute thing? You just launch it out. I don't know. I you just I, hit the. I don't think I was able to do it before, and then. Well, your body's just, just training after a while. And then I kind of just learned. There's not like a proper sitting position where like it's like one ass cheek on one side of the toilet seat, then the other on the other. To yeah. like no. get as much opening for your asshole as no, possible. No, you just sit down and then you just have to learn like know how to engage those muscles right away and, yeah. and just, wow. you're done with it. <laughs> I hate when I like chop. Right? Up. Are you one of the people that have to kind of like sit down? Like you can't just. Crap it's not that I have down. to. It's I want to, and I make sure I have that time and that peace to do it. Yeah, that's probably what it is for, for most precious. people. I just like to go. It's super precious. Mm -hmm. I don't think we appreciate like body bodily functions like that enough. Like, they're awesome. They're amazing. I, I appreciate them. <laughs> they're plenty. so good. I appreciate bodily functions. Especially when you're jerking it off too at the same <laughs> time. <laughs> Blumpkin. Yeah, Blumpkin. I, I remember Mido saying a uh, or bumpkin. Blumpkin. No, but uh, no, I think okay. a bumpkin is when you're getting a blowjob and you're shitting at the same time. Oh, that's not, oh yeah, that's I, that's what I thought. Yeah. Blump. <laughs> what? That's hella nasty. Do the windows open? Right the windows open. Imagine if someone's place. just listening to us. 
like talking about shit and our shit <laughs> habits. Yeah, the, the, the <laughs> yeah, I like how Armageddon tries to <laughs> the cover courage. the window. <laughs> what were you saying? Crap, I don't know. Oh, um, I remember. I think it was when Mido got his first apartment. I remember he said uh, he invests like in more expensive toilet paper because <laughs> because like those moments are so precious. Mm. He's like, you only got one life. You got, you got, right? Wasn't it you? I'm yeah. pretty sure it was you. You're like, yeah. using you got a wipe. No, it wasn't. Mm. It, it was just. Uh, more you did have, it was just more yeah. ply. No, yeah. you, had, ply. you had you yeah. had some yeah. super plush. I remember you, you used to have some super plush toilet paper. I changed that. Now I go to Costco and get like yeah. decent, <laughs> now I get like decent. That's ones. the best toilet paper. Honestly, I have Angel Soft right now and it's terrible. I hate Charmin. It's too damn soft. Too soft, here. huh? Yeah, like it's just too. I feel soft. like it's what? gonna go in it my ass. It breaks up. It breaks up. It's like it's just it's not good toilet paper. Yeah, I like Costco what, toilet what paper. What did you have That's before? Good. It was like Colton or something. Yeah, it was. I think it was like Charmin or something like that. Colton Northern. Quilted. Actually, that 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 that's a good toilet paper. It is. Quilted. Quilted. Yeah. You know what I hate when you fucking chop off a thing prematurely. You chop off a and it's just like a little stump. And you, you can fill it in there, huh? And every yeah. time you wipe, you're just like uh, you're just wait, like grinding cold? down, grinding down a little turd. Like you're wasting so much toilet paper. Right? Yeah. You, yeah. You I get an infinity that. wipe hey, going, yeah. or as long as you oh. keep. It. You and then the opposite, which is you poop and then you wipe and there's nothing on toilet oh, paper. Those are miracles. Ghost poop. Yeah, ghost poop. <laughs> you know all about that, huh? Yeah, rumor <laughs> has it. Take a different type of ghost poop. Rumor yeah. has it that uh, that's where like that poop that like, gets transferred to the Bermuda Triangle. Do you know that? Wait, how? The, sh- the shit. What? That's where it goes. It goes to like a parallel universe. Or it can You mean it came from a parallel universe? No, it goes to a parallel universe. Why is it gonna go to a parallel universe? You're flushing it down the toilet. No, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't think no, this like, through enough. No, like <laughs> when you wipe and there's nothing there. Yeah. It's because that shit that was on there, it's in a parallel universe. But you see it in the toilet. It's somewhere else. No, you see it in the toilet. No, you don't. No, you don't. It, no it, there's nothing. No, I'm talking about the actual... Toilet paper? ...turn that you oh, took. Oh, no, no, I'm <laughs> talking about the wipage afterwards. Do you guys ever, like, spell letters? Like, mine? I always get, like, giant-ass what? J's. Like, mine come out, like, giant capital <laughs> J's. Like, you spell help? Oh, you're saying... <laughs> 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 Please help. My, my shit like, says, stop eating. Uh, it's like SOS. You've had SOS. enough. Save our shit. Life expectancy, 20 years. Hey, I'm five years over that. Enough so I'm good. Burger King. I'm enough good. Burger King. More Subway. <laughs> I'm good. Actually, Subway sounds really good. Right uh, now. Do you guys have any crap your, crap your stories? Crap yourself stories? Uh, crap myself. The only time I crap myself was middle school i was on my way to school i was walking to school mm-hmm. and uh man now that i think about it i wonder if this was one that's probably what no because i'm thinking of that if that's when i like started having stomach problems but i don't think so i think it just hit me out of nowhere i think i was walking that's hey that's mine hey that's part of mine too we can have some what? So water, yeah, yeah. What waterfall? Like my water is story. What waterfall? Oh my God. You interrupted it, man. I was trying to, I was trying hey, to like hey, whisper to hey, him. Josh, can I have but that's my water. We broke out to a fucking water war. A this is the water, water bottle. Water. I'm the water boy. That's why I deserve it. Yeah, because it's the last I'm water. Just, oh my gosh. <laughs> Everyone else is going to have to drink their piss. <laughs> my dubla, I'm a guy. Alright, let me get it. Just give me, give me at least a cap. I'm a bust. Give me a cap. I'm going to bust the fucking Trump. Bust a cap on my ass. I'm going to bust the Trump right now. Trump's playing a Trump. What is that? That's how he drinks water. What? He drinks water with two hands like a fucking baby really yeah he goes like yeah. this look <laughs> and he goes like he puts it down it's so cute <laughs> it's so cool, that's my president that's my little cutie here you go hey waterfall it so we can all drink like trump though uh, unless it's not cool drink it like obama I guess sideways just... like that <laughs> like you hold a gun like a black like, like a gun. Mm. You're a little Obama bear. <laughs> You're an Obama bear. Go back to your story, though. Go. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Oh, wait. I gotta drink water now. Oh, he looks cool. He's all, like, lit up. Yeah, little just, toad. Just see the Before everyone became H2 hose. With hmm. that uh, water bottle. H2 hose? H2 hose. So. Yep. H2 bros. Oh, that's nice. That's a cool mm. name. Right? H2, H2, H2 clothes. H2 clothes? Clothes? I was pretty much, uh. I don't know why I do that. Walking towards <laughs> the school or whatever, and. I think it's like a good qu- three quarters of a mile, maybe. Mm-hmm. And uh, I just I couldn't make it, and I ended up crapping myself. Like it just came out of nowhere, and I had to crap really bad. Oh. And um, 
Like your stomach wasn't hurting beforehand, or was it? No. I don't Damn, think it was. that's scary. Yeah, <laughs> that is scary. But you've had, you guys had it, experience like that, right? Like, uh, you never had like all of a sudden like you, so you within like a minute or two, like damn, I have to go like. Take oh a yeah, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you made it seem like you were just completely fine, and all of a sudden you just shit yourself. <laughs> no, mine is no, like no, oh, no, no, no. So you got you got a bowel, bowel bowel uh, Alzheimer's, huh? Like bowel? like your bowels had bowels Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's? For a second, like yeah. you know, you get Alzheimer's, you forget what you're doing, you forget where you are, you forget where you're going, hey, and like what's going on. Correct term is Alzheimer's. Uh, like, how could you didn't? There was no hey, it's like Alzheimer's. Hey. It just happened. You just hey. no, 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 no. Yeah, I, I, I guess that's where the confusion is. No, I started Alzheimer's. feeling it. Alzheimer's. Oh, Alzheimer's. No, yeah, Alzheimer's. I, I, I started feeling it, but I, I was I was like right. past half ways to right. already get to the school. So like I started feeling. So I'm just trying to make it to school at this point, and I I couldn't make it, and I think I was. I was probably like a quarter of a mile away from the school, like left. So I was just trying to make it, and yeah, I crapped myself, and I was like, "Well, I'm not going to school." <laughs> so you walked back so you with walk crap. Back home with shit. Yeah, well, I had to. Well, like, what does it feel like? You yeah, were supposed to go to class, sit your ass down, and <laughs> read your little book. I don't no, like, I don't know. Known until it was quiet in the huh? class, and you sat down, and all you, all you hear is. Yeah, Why wouldn't uh, you just march on forward to school and then wipe your ass in the in the yeah. restroom? He shit his pants. Yeah, I'm right. gonna ask one of your best buds if they you could uh, have their underwear or something. Oh, <laughs> we were, we were well, so they could be without underwear. Yeah, <laughs> I would do it. You should have went to class and pretended like nothing happened and waited for everyone to be like, what's that smell? And you're like, I don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and like, when they're like, did you shit yourself? Or you just like refuse to. No. You shit up. yourself, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> you shit yourself. <laughs> Fuck you. Shaming me. Ass shaming me. <laughs> you said ass shaming. Fuck you. <laughs> Damn, that's, yeah. my, that's my only story. So it was, was it water or was it solid? No, water? luckily it was solid. Oh, like what? solid you enough. You scooped it out like out of a kitty litter. You <laughs> scooped it, throw it out. <laughs> Bury it. <laughs> like a little dog. Damn. So it was just like rocks rolling off of a cliff. You know how like sometimes there's like a an avalanche. Oh, are you talking about how you feel it? Yeah, it fell down your pants. Yeah, your you pants. Kind of, yeah, you kind of just like. <laughs> it went into his shoe. You start stepping on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it just kind of like tumbles down. Uh, Did it come out of your leg? Well, oh no, like out of your pants? Because uh, back in the day, that's when like people oh, were wearing yeah, ru rubber, rubber bands, bands on oh, their pants. Oh, so, <laughs> yeah, dude, I, 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 I had to let it out. I had to let it out, and then you know, you had to let it, it out and find its own way. Yeah, <laughs> back to the sewers. yeah. <laughs> I was like, there, there you go, you're free. <laughs> was there anyone around? Nah. So were you late this to school? Only... Were you walking late to school? No, I don't. Think, I don't think I went to school at all that day. I just took the day off. What happened? You, what'd you tell? So what happened when you went back home? You told your dad and your mom. <laughs> this is my grandma, and I just told her I was like, yeah, I, had, I, I crapped myself. Like, I was trying to get. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, okay, so then you got up to your house, right? You walked back home, right? And yeah. then we walked through the front door. What was your grandma's place or your house? Oh, uh, my grandma's. So then you walked through the door. Where's your grandma? Yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't have a clear yeah. like memory of like she was on the everything that happened. <laughs> I just. I just know for sure I got there and I uh, I think she was like, what? Like, like, what are you doing? You know, like, what the heck are you doing? And I was just like, uh, I was like, oh, you know, I just kind of like try to explain myself all awkwardly. Uh, I was just like, yeah, I kind of like crap myself. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and <laughs> she was like, you lose it. <laughs> Dude, you're lucky it wasn't in current. No, she would have Snapchatted that. She would have put that on Twitter. <laughs> just lose your shit himself. <laughs> yeah, that'd be a jacked up grandma. <laughs> <laughs> that's how grandmas are in 2018. Dang. Yeah. Damn, that's funny. Uh, I'm not really like, I'm pretty sure other people have like probably some humiliating stories. Like, I, that's just, I'm just like, well, yeah, I crap myself. Yeah, mine, I was in middle school. Mine's different. And my, like, our shits are completely different. Our accidents are different. Oh, yeah. And it's kind of perplexing because, like, you said yours was solid. Uh -huh. The only time, like, that happened to me, it was like diarrhea. And you know how diarrhea, mm. like, can't be stopped? When you have diarrhea, that means you're sick. Yours it's was a, just like, not. yeah, that <laughs> means like something's wrong with you and it needs to come out. Yours was an actual solid thing, which is like, like your shit did that's you what I'm saying. That's why it's so weird. <laughs> it, didn't, did you solid? it didn't do me a solid. It did you a solid by being a solid. Uh, yeah. And then like mine, uh, mine was like, you could tell it was coming because like my stomach was turning. Stop turning no, that. but see, I don't know if you heard, heard me and that's what uh, Armageddon was asking. It didn't just like come out of nowhere. Like I felt it, oh, okay. but it escalated really fast. Hmm. 
So and, really and to get to school, it's like 20 minutes. Yeah. So, you so want... like five minutes into walking, you know, I, I probably got like a feeling. I was like, well, I'm going to school. I'm like, crap at school. Yeah. You but... know, one of those rubber bands you had on your legs, you should have got, grabbed both of them and put them on your fucking waist or something. Or you should have <laughs> put them like on a spot, of you, like somewhere on your body where it would have kept the shit up <laughs> coming out of your ass. That's possible. Damn. Like a tourniquet or something. But, uh, What's a tourniquet? I always hear that. Like yeah. uh, whenever it stops you get, bleeding. Yeah, it stops the yeah. bleeding. But what is it physically? It it's like this. What does it look like? Oh, it's like yeah, you it wrap can, like it, it's that fucking it, thing around. It could yeah. be anything, but there's stop actual bleeding. a tourniquet's like an actual, actual thing, thing that you can put on. That's what Bruce Will- Willis does anything. when he gets shot, and then he puts like a little shirt, rips his shirt in half. No, that, that's, that's not it. No, he rips no. off a little piece of the American flag. And that's not a tourniquet. <laughs> he it around. When you see that in movies, that's not a tourniquet. A tourniquet. Like that thing gets hella tight. Like it hurts. Like you, like you can, like you basically you... wrap it around your arm. The right, and you, you cut off. Like you stop. No, the so, so if you're gonna do like your own tourniquet, so say you are gonna use a shirt or something, uh-huh. you're supposed to get a shirt, tie it, and then get like a like something that's strong, but like kind of like a stick, like something long, mm-hmm. and then you kind of tie it again with the shirt, and then you get that long stick or whatever, and you twist, and oh, you twist, and you twist. Okay. And you, you twist so much until, like, if, like, uh, it's squirting or whatever, like, <laughs> it'll literally stop. Whoa. And then, um... This is Tourniquet Tips with Ghost. Check out his YouTube video. <laughs> Link's in the description. Oh, yeah. Here's a detailed video of him doing a tourniquet. Shame. I can't even put a tourniquet on myself. He stabs him. He slices himself <laughs> open just so he could show you. That, that, that's how he died. That's just like died. Bear Grylls. That's how he died for real. It's like when Bear Grylls is like, I'm going to show you now how to survive in freezing water. And then he jumps in the water. How, how am I going to show that if I'm a ghost though? No, uh, that's he true. Did. He, he recorded it before he died. Yeah, and that's how he died. I love how we have so many explanations <laughs> of how a ghost died. Well, like, <laughs> yeah, he's a ghost, so he's many different entities. Oh, remember how you died? Your rectum blew out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wait, did I ever... You, you did. On what? What was it? On uh, our really? channel. Oh, I don't remember dying did. that way. The water bottle? Oh, yeah, the water bottle. You died. <laughs> yeah. You blew out your rectum. That was a story when you oh, were walking to Oh, right school. now, earlier. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's coming full I'm like, circle. I'm like Kenny. Yeah, now. That's why I have all these death stories. I just like re- reincarnate and then I die again. <laughs> but most of my time is just spent as a ghost. <laughs> that's pretty sick. I, I like that comparison, actually. That's sweet. Anyone else have any um, shit stories? Shit um, themselves. Yeah, I do. Someone else shit themselves. Oh, yeah, you, you didn't really... I don't want to talk about it. No, you <laughs> have to talk about it. Nah. It's a circle of trust. You oh, have to trust. Like rectangle. This is like a... Uh, you, you guys don't have... Therapy. This is a support group. You guys have any stories? <laughs> no. No? Uh, I, feel like, uh, I feel like I've talked I mean, too much already. Lucky I used bastards. to always have... Like a year and a half, I had diarrhea, but... Oh, yeah, I remember that. You were, like, absent from school every day. <laughs> yeah. Why did you go to school? Uh, my stomach hurt. <laughs> I had diarrhea all day long. What was I supposed to do? You did. That's yeah. weird. I think you were just eating, like, Taco Bell. All no, time it's the time. medicine I was on. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah. I did. Yeah, it's crazy I remember that. Well, I guess my story... Um, and that's why I'm so scared to have my ass eaten. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want the diarrhea to come back at the wrong time? I don't. All over her fucking face. Well... We like the chocolate. <laughs> long story short, uh, long story short, uh, went to Hollywood Video back when it was open. Like, wow. you know, if you don't know what Hollywood Video is, it's like Blockbuster. Was Hollywood Video worldwide? Worldwide? I thought it was on the local. Okay, yeah, that was it's a local like, one. It's like Blockbuster. If you guys, whoever's listening, doesn't I was know. Go to the back room, or the porn section. There's a porn section in Hollywood yeah, Video. The whole back. They had like a curtain that uh, covered it up. I don't know. I, I always wanted to go in there when I was a kid. What a shame when I able to do that. <laughs> yeah, that's mystical. But anyway, yeah, I went there. It's like Blockbuster. And then um, I was with my brother, and we were, like, looking for stuff. We're going to walk. Oh, we were going to get Hot Fuzz, that movie Hot Fuzz. So I don't know what year did that come out, just to Dude, give some. you were, like, in middle school. Fuzz. Yeah, I was not I was pretty older. <laughs> you... Oh, wait, no. Hot Fuzz came out when we were in high school, I think. Okay, I was in high I think I was. I had to be a freshman then. <laughs> Hot Fuzz? Is that a porn? Is, 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 is that a porn? Is, no, it's, no, uh, it's, it's a, like a uh, cop movie. It's really funny. You yeah. should watch it. Yeah. Um, oh, so we got Hot Fuzz. Oh, my stomach was like hurting. Like, <laughs> like when you're just hitting puberty, you got Hot Fuzz down there. You got some Hot Fuzz. Some hot Fuzz. Put your Hot Fuzz on my mouth. <laughs> well, yeah, and then so I was like, damn, I hope we like hurry up because I got it. I have diarrhea. I can tell. Like, it's what it wants to come out. But then it took long and then like I wasn't on the car ride home. I wasn't going to make it. I could already tell. And I was like, fuck. <laughs> I, just dro- I was like, just drop me off. Just drop me off, please. And then you know the, the thoughts? <laughs> the thoughts of like, man, please nobody be in the bathroom please please and i go through the door i'm like 
knocking on the door, like, doo, 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 and the screen door, and I'm like, Mom, whoever, like, open up, open the door, and she opens it, I run, I run through, and sure enough, my brother's taking a shower, and I start banging on the door, I'm like, let me in, and we had, there's two doors to that bathroom, so, like, I can, um, I can unlock the other one, I'm like, hey, look, you know, I'm calling his name, like, let me in, let me in, and he's like, no, just wait, just wait, and I was like, I'm coming in, fuck it, <laughs> so I open it, but it's too late, like, I open the door, and, like, I uh, pull my pants down and I shit, but the, <laughs> dude, but the, I, this before your body was strained. Right? I almost made it, but guess what? The lid was down. <laughs> so I shit all over the lid <laughs> and I got all over everything, and then like, so I lifted it up and then I shit the rest of it, and I was just like, oh, and my brother was like. <laughs> What the fuck, man? Yo, man, you're fucking gay. He was like, man, you're so fucking gay. You're so fucking gay, man. Like, and he was just pissed. And I, I was like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And I was like shitting. And then uh, I still remember I'm that. Sorry. Yeah, I remember that. I was like so like embarrassed and devastated that I was like, oh, like we had gotten pizza, so it was like supposed to be like a fun day and I, I was like crying <laughs> I started crying <laughs> and I was like oh. and then like I didn't go out anymore and my brother I still remember my brother was like come on just come out come out I was like nah come I'm just gonna stay in my again. room yeah it was him that was the that day that was a pretty eventful day <laughs> uh, yeah now I remember you telling me this story oh you do yeah. yeah that was my I think that's the only time the other times would be when I was a baby I can't believe you for that <laughs> <clears throat> That's my shit story. Damn, so everything went wrong that day. The lid was down. Someone was in the shower. The pizza was cold. Yeah. Hot fuzz. fuzz. It was the wrong movie. You know, some people believe that you can actually eat, like, uh, you can hit a certain mark of eating, I guess, where you won't have shit at all. You like, like, you'll just piss? Little? Piss? You'll just piss? No, like, there's some. Uh, well, I don't know if some people, I don't know if it's a fucking group or anything, but there was this dude who was on uh, the Joe Rogan podcast. And he literally had an argument with Joe Rogan because he said that there's a magic, there's like a quota of how much you eat to where your body will retain all of it. And it won't need it to uh, get rid of anything at all. That's simply not true. Yeah. What the heck? Yeah. Weird. I was thinking of, I was thinking of it like in a different way. I thought he was going to say like you're constantly eating just like small per yeah. portions and your yeah. body uses up just breaking it down. Yeah, all of it. Basically, where, I guess. But, that's but just, if you're saying like he has, you're saying like a big amount, right? No, no she's saying the perfect amount so that it soaks it all in and it, yeah. there's no waste, I guess. You won't waste uh, like it uses every single bit of it. Um, but that's not how waste works. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Um, I think you, like, if, there's a magic number not to not crap at all, but like, yeah, it'll take you, you know, a long time because obviously your body's just gathering, gathering, gathering. If gather. you just drink nothing but water stuff, like, uh, will you crap? Yeah. Still? Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. just flushing it out it's just the same thing like when you juice something you know how you juice it and then there's still the pulp or the fiber left uh, like it, you, yeah you'll still like build up that stuff inside of you man I haven't have juiced since I took steroids <laughs> most of it juiced <laughs> <clears throat> alright you guys want to talk about something else yeah, uh, yeah. I, I saw this thing in the hat where it said something about uh, new races of people what's that about uh, <laughs> if we think there's going to be new races of people oh Pretty self-explanatory. Like, do you think we're done? Can you like, explain you think that? Races are done. Like, for instance, we got black people, we got Mexicans, we got whites, we got Hawaiian, we got everything in between. Like, are we done making new people? Like, is there gonna be one person who fucks this other weird person who has like so many like races? They're like their ethnicity is like so like broad, I guess, with so many different types of uh, genes. Are we gonna, <laughs> Were you gonna like, say yeah, so you can get someone like you can get like an Indonesian Frenchman or some? Well, not <laughs> well, <laughs> Indonesian French, Frenchman from France. <laughs> No, but like an, an entire different person with like different French? traits, like different French, <laughs> the way they look. A and Hawaiian fucking Indonesian. What did wait. you say? <laughs> uh, got, oh, got an Indonesian Frenchman. An that's Indonesian. not real. French like, isn't a race. I'm pretty sure. Thing. Yeah, that's a real thing. Well, no, saying, that's so just you, a European. So no, it's not like the French. Like oh, the French people. The French. I'm French. French but you're fries. literally. So if you get if you get a, if, French is like somebody who either came from Indonesia. No. And then declare no. themselves. So the dad like was French, French and the mom was Indonesian. So the kid came out of French and Indonesian. Indonesia? I thought Indonesia then, was like in Africa. No. And then he had he ends up uh, banging uh, this girl that's African and like Argentinian. Well, Wait, what? Where's this going? I heard a thing <laughs> that um. Well, eventually we're all gonna become one race. You've heard that, right? Have you guys ever heard that? 
Because we're all having sex with each other. Gene we're all going to be one. We're going to be like a weird brown person. Because they showed a picture of oh, what yeah, the future person that. would look like. It mm. looked all weird. I like. I saw that and people were like, she's beautiful. I was like, she looks like shit. And people were like getting all mad at me. <laughs> but I mean, it's true. She wasn't pretty. Did she look like a little shit? No, she looked, yeah, she looked weird. Like, yeah, she looked weird. Kind of like in FIFA. Or like, yeah, I, I guess FIFA because that's the one what? where I created. <laughs> she looked like, like PS2. I think you compare this to FIFA. Because in FIFA, I created like, <laughs> weird looking people like with really dark skin and really light eyes and like jacked up hair. And that's exactly what she looked like. Yeah, like a fake person. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So, you think we're gonna become aliens? Nah. Yeah. Wait, what? Like what do you, you mean? Mean, uh, know that we're classic alien, alien, like that classic image of an alien with the big hair, the small, like like no nose or something. Yeah, like that big dumb. Yeah. Like people have literally broken it down to where they say that we are gonna become that image because the big head represents us communicating telepathically, because we won't need to because of technology, and then the eyes that are like kind of black. Kind of like, a, like it looks like a screen or something, mm. like see, like, like, a, like a like a like a, a fly's eye, they see and that's light. because of the atmosphere, like in their skin too, like their skin, our skin's gonna change to that color, mm. like that thick, rough, gray, yeah, reptilian type skin because of the atmosphere. We can't like we can't live in it right now with how our anatomy is right now. And then the reason why they don't have any sex organs is because we no longer need to do that to reproduce because now we genetically modify human beings, so we've lost the purpose to re, uh, repopulate. Sexual. Yeah, no, that's never gonna happen. But they pee out of their fingers, they right? They pee out of their fingers. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Scary movie. I got this hard, I'll be right back. Three. <laughs> uh, you gonna go, you gonna go pee out of your fingers? This one's taking the shit. Or, hey, watch him. See if he pees out of his fingers. He's <laughs> an alien. Yeah, apparently yeah. there's 12 species of alien. There's a lot. Of like, alien? Yeah. There's different species. They... People have came up with 12, there's 12 different yeah. kinds. Like oh, green of ones. what they're saying of species that's Tall actually out there? Tall and short ones, green ones, blue ones. What the heck? Avatar ones. Um, man, I wanted to segue into something, but I want to wait till Just he's do it. back. That's a um, loud piss stream. Yeah. Man, he must have a big dick. Well, Go back to episode what? Three? Three? Piss stream? Wait, no, that was one. That's, one. Your, that's the one that you guys did. Without me. Oh, you weren't there? It's episode one. Yeah. Oh, you were in the... Ender Flashback to episode one, season one. <laughs> Dude, you have a big dick. We heard you piss. Dude. Mm. Oh, your yeah. finger pisses loud. Mm. You have a big finger now. Damn. That's great. Now, what I was going to say, I watched a video where it was explaining um when, like... When and if we get to the point where we uh, are able to colonize other planets, um, as time goes by, hu humans will, are going to start to become totally different because the, they're going to adapt to that type of environment on that planet. So a human from one planet over, you know, I don't know how long it would be, but uh, they're going to look different from like a human on Earth. And over a large amount of time, like thousands of years, um, even though we started whatever, like humans here on Earth, we would develop into totally like two different species. If we were, you know, go super, super, super far in the future and we colonize other planets. I don't think that would ever happen, though. I think, I think we're just going to kill ourselves before we get there. And we're going to start all over. I don't think we're going to... That's just, possible. I think that's just... No, that's I a legit, think that's that's a legit human, possibility. I think, honestly, 100%. that's just what, the, kill the nature of humans. Like Not kill ourselves, like, su like a mass suicide, but, but we're going like, to get killed off. Either we kill off because of our own devices. Yeah. War, I think, obviously. I think, well, every so many years, I think every so many years, the population starts over. Yeah, it's happened. Yeah. What's the fucking the, yeah, the, the structure called? Go back uh, to Tempe. Yeah. Yeah, basically a big asteroid is just going to hit us again, and then we're going to start all over. No, yeah, that video said that it's it's more likely that we're going to get hit by a meteor before yeah, we can colonize other... Because it's happened... Planet. But I'm pretty sure again. this video was released before Elon Musk started, like, came on the scene. and yeah, Dude, he's Elon, you can't moves. listen to he's Elon Superman. Musk. Superman. Huh? You know he's Superman. a fucking he idiot. He thinks that we live in the Matrix. Who? Elon Musk. Yeah, oh no, but did, he's a fucking did, whack dude. job. No, he's a whack job. No, I mean, he thinks it we're makes, in the Matrix. Have you have you actually uh, yeah, broken down that theory? He, he thinks he's Neo. No, it's crazy. Dude, it's no, it's awesome. Have you heard that bad. theory? No, I haven't. Oh, dude, it, like it's a it's just a, a, like a mind fuck. We're living in much. someone else's shit, right? Pretty much, but like this this is where it. You start to kind of believe, like, believe in the possibility. Mm -hmm. um, think about our video games right now. And then think about VR. Mm -hmm. And then automation and AI. Uh, they're saying, like, well, you know, we're progressing. Our technology is getting more and more advanced. To a point, we, you know, it's possible that we can develop an AI to resemble, you know, like, um, just, like, human behavior. To where, you know, we can make a simulator. So if we ever get to a point where we can simulate other humans or whatever in, you know, in an environment and create mm -hmm. like a, you know, a mini digital universe, we pretty much created ourselves. 
Well, and then, the and then, holy fuck! It, it's just a loop. But so you have that with the Sims, right? Like how huh? you just you log on the game and they're like doing their own thing already in a way. If that makes sense. Like, but it's, it's no, you gotta think. But you gotta think way beyond. Though. You have yeah. to think way beyond that. You're giving you're giving just, another like entity a free will, basically. Like you're you're mm -hmm. you're generating an entirety, like an entirely no, different. No, that's what I'm saying. Like if you don't do anything, living like, your, your Sims do everything by themselves. Like they take over and do whatever they're gonna do. Oh, in Sims Four. But it's predictable. Yeah. Oh. I don't and know, and they're confined in that You're talking about like when you're not on, right? Like yeah, like, like yeah, like kept if you on. just watch it. Don't go. And oh, do when you watch it, that's I get what you're saying. You, yeah, you get what I'm saying, right? Like yeah, I get what you're saying. Or like, I guess video games too. How you said, like if you set it, like if you if you tell them to like build something, mm. and then you turn it off, and the next day they built that plus something else. Like, yeah, they took it, it upon themselves to build something else. It's just it's a it's a digital world. Like yeah. there's physics in that world, even though like we're we're seeing it on the screen. Uh, and that's why when you think of VR, you can actually go into that three 3D world, you know, and you see it um, just like how we see everything right now like in 3D. Um, but yeah, that's just pretty much a theory. Like, it's, you know, it's just this uh, kind of like loophole. Can just I read this on. to you guys? Yeah, yeah go, go for it. It just says, uh, Elon Musk, the billionaire, Andre okay, I don't need it. Founder of SpaceX, Tesla, and PayPal. Damn, he made, he made PayPal too? Oh yeah, that's how he made, well, like he started his fortune. He has told almost lost Some people it. think he's the inventor of Bitcoin too. Some people. Who the fuck is this guy? Where'd he come from? Future. Let's take him apart. Take his brain out. He's fucking See what he can do. Something. I want to poke his he's brain with a stick. Dude. He's something. Uh, he's something he, else. He's like he a, a you know like he's not human. He just. I, th I think he just had. I think his dad. He he had an awesome dad. Pretty much his dad. I think got him into like coding like at an early age. I, I I'm pretty sure you hear of like parents that do that. You know, introduced him into a field like at an early age. Like it, you know, mm -hmm. just different things to get him into. But yeah, he learned how to code like. When he was I think one. thirteen, because he I think he coded a uh, PayPal like Halle Young. He made Minecraft too. Says here, <laughs> he goes by the name of Notch, which is a simulation. Bros? Yeah. You mean Minecraft? And then no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's a good idea. No. He wouldn't even waste his time on Minecraft. I know he would what make like that? he would like make Roblox because Roblox is so much makes better. Makes space Minecraft. Okay, he's told in an interview there's He'd only like Spore. That would be his game. Or I still want to play <laughs> Spore. I remember <laughs> that fucking Spore? game. Is that game still available? Yeah, I can still buy that I've game. I always wanted to play it. Spore. <laughs> I, mean, I can play it to this day and have fun, right? Yeah, probably. Like I've I've gone back and played it, and it's you know it's fun to a point, but uh, I realize when you compare it to games nowadays, it's just. But what game is like that right <laughs> so... now? <laughs> oh, like it? Yeah. That I can compare to it. What's a game out right now? Uh, like no Man's games. Sky. No, hell no. <laughs> There's nothing, right? Um, Elon Musk made no. Nah, well, it, like what part yeah, of it? The part, the evolution part, or yeah, like the space travel? It's fine. We'll come back to it. Uh, oh, there's yeah. a lot of space travel <laughs> games now. What about evolution like that? I want to play a game like. There's that. more games coming out, but not to the how Spore went about so it. So I should go back and definitely get that game then, right? Yeah, no, no. There's no game out that I know of that goes about evolution the way that. That game. If you guys I, could, uh, in the comments, give me a, link. give me some games that are like that. Okay. That'd be great. I thought you were gonna ask like for the game key. <laughs> Can you guys uh, like buy me the game instead of doing? I was like, damn, like, dude. Buy me the game through PayPal. <laughs> damn, that you, someone could do that, huh? What? Like if if you ask for a game key and you had dude, a big following, they could probably give you buy like, it for you. Huh? There's, there's podcasts. Yeah, I mean, there's YouTube. people that have donated they, yeah, stuff they, to. They do live stream podcasts YouTubers. and people donate like 200, 300 bucks like right off the bat. Oh man. yeah. I always wonder, not to be mean, but I always wonder, like, who the fuck does that? Like, even if I had money, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't give money to somebody. Oh, uh, but what if it's... Yeah, but it's cool because... Someone that really, it's like... It's part of your community that you like. Yeah, like, something you're really, really yeah. into for, I don't know. Like, say you had, like... Like, Smash? I yeah, like, say there, was, say there was, just like, this huge, like, podcast where, like, he was, like, doing great stuff and... He, like, and you want to see more. Yeah, like, yeah, oh, I'm going to give him, like, ten bucks just to help him out. Maybe he can get something with this or, you know... Nah. It's more of it's more of like, and it's you like pay, I want to get it they, free. It's, it's less time for them to be. Yeah, it's already work. free content. But if you have them out, they get better equipment, they get better studio, it's less, yeah, it's and that all them. it like uh, like garners attraction. And if there's more attraction, you get better guests, you get better conversations. You get yeah. No, I know why they better. do it. I'm just saying I wouldn't ever do it. No. Uh, be, that being said, guys, if you guys want to give us some money on Patreon, go ahead. I'll set it up right yeah. now. It's true. Why are you saying that? Uh, you know, I appreciate Just all you guys. through our Facebook. I need better equipment. I need a new game. 
I need a new, <laughs> I need a new uh, MCF. Games that you say you don't play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, Elon Musk. I'm not reading anything. So, uh, I'm just coming from my head. Did you hear? Did you hear me explain the whole theory about the Matrix? The, yeah. yeah, the Matrix. Yeah, it says right here that um, there's only a one in billions chance that we're not living in a computer simulation. Speaking at San Francisco's Code Conference this week, Musk said that he has had so many simulation discussions, it's crazy, and that it got to the point where every conversation he had was uh, was AI simulation conversation. He also claimed that if we're not living in a simulation we could be approaching the end of the world. Yeah, sound? that's more likely. You know, people that are like uh, super prominent minds when it comes to like all this AI shit and everything dealing with like the advancement of our future. Uh-huh. They literally believe that AI is just a bad thing. Like that's they're what terrified. Stephen Hawking, they, he, Stephen Hawking said. Like he's like, it's a bad fucking thing. They said like uh, up until like a week before he died, like he was pushing that. Like uh, he was giving warnings. Some people were saying that's actually why he died too. Jesus yeah. Christ, I Gross. forgot what it was but there was these two robots who they had to stop like their their development for them because they were uh they were uh, creating their own language with each other yeah <laughs> they they literally created a language so they can they can uh disguise like every dialogue they're having so they can be like secretive okay. towards the people that are creating them like the engineers oh that's how smart those fucking robots are those ais where'd you hear that at? <laughs> they had to stop i forgot where it was we have to look it up it's not credible i wish, we, I wish we, exactly. we could look up things it is look it up we can look up things the power uh, of the laptop i mean it says us because we're just like i heard it in a video <laughs> somewhere i can't remember <clears throat> Man, I know I need a fucking... Yeah, no, that does sound... I, 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 I want to know, actually. That, language. I don't need to look it up because I have a computer right here in my brain. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what? What do you want me to think about? You have a Windows 95 computer. Oh, uh, I would so... <laughs> what do you want me to think about? Look up <laughs> ro- Look up robots create their own language. Let me think about it really quick. Wow. And then look up... Uh, <laughs> look up uh, a porn site. Uh, what was that thing you told me to think about? Robots create their own language. Your own original thought? Yeah. yeah. Let me just uh, comb through my mind really quick. Oh, yeah, I remember. Uh, you found it? Yeah, that's when Facebook shut down robots after they invented their own language. Oh, yeah, I was talking to you about that. Wait, the how hall. recent was this? Oh, really? Yeah, when Facebook, like years uh, ago? there was code. I think it was fairly recently. Yeah, it was, remember at, we were at, we were mm. playing pool. We were having a few brewskis, had, you know, Probably. having some ladies next to us. And we started <laughs> talking about Mark Fuckerberg. <laughs> and how, uh, like, code, there was code. <laughs> <laughs> Those ghost farts, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> Fuck. They're not worse than the Armageddon farts, though, that's for sure. <laughs> you know when Armageddon farts. I mean, my farts never smell. <laughs> to you. Yeah, so ba- like, Facebook shit on a pair of uh, its artificial intelligence robots after they invented their own language. It's pretty crazy. Is it there? Yeah, researchers at Facebook, artificial intelligence research, built a chat bot earlier this year. What it was meant doing? to learn how to negotiate by mimicking human trading and... Bartering. It's pretty crazy. Then it did exactly what it was supposed to do. Yeah. But when the social network paired two of the programs, nicknamed Alice and Bob, to trade against each other, they started to learn their own bizarre form of communication. That's pretty scary. That is some Terminator shit right there. (laughs) That's scary as fuck. Yeah, it it depends. And then there's already this robot. Yeah, it has to be a robot. It's an AI. It, uh, It played the world's greatest chess player. And I think it, it beat him, like, within that same day. Or, like, a few tries. It bested him, like, that quick. Yeah. Uh, you know what video I haven't watched? Because I guess uh, Elon Musk... <laughs> Nobody not, said not, anything. pretty sure it's not him himself. <laughs> we don't care. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, seg- I like, I'm building oh, okay. off what he, he, oh, said. he said. Um, you know, it wasn't... I'm pretty sure it's not, like, Elon Musk. You know, he has, like, this incredible team or whatever, like, in all his projects. But they... Uh, it must be, like, SpaceX, maybe? Um... Their AI, they uh, they had their AI uh, play um, professional, like the pros in like esports. So mm-hmm. like uh, whatever big esport it was, I don't know if it was like League of Legends Shout or out, Dota NBA, or you know, um, like the big big esports. I'm pretty sure it was one of those, like uh, League of Legends or Dota. Um, they played against the AI, but uh, I, I I didn't watch the whole thing. I don't mm-hmm. know who won or what. But I think yeah, I want to. Huh? Was it doing well? Yeah, no, that, that AI that I think it is SpaceX, the one that they have, it's supposed to be, like, incredible. Yeah, it doesn't mess up. There's no mistake. It, uh, it's, uh, I think it's, uh, like, self-teaching. It'll, it'll learn. 
And I think I think those AIs are learning from like um, Siri and like all those other ones, like what well, Google just, has and yeah, Amazon. It's just one big bank that they're probably and like. From. Yeah, I th- but those series are like the first. Those are like the like they're feeding like bigger AIs that are gonna come in the future. I now guess. they have big speed. Daddy series because they're like recognizing voices. They're uh, being faces. asked things. And yeah, faces like they're literally gaining like so much knowledge. I would think it's gonna get to the point I'm, where they can I'm replicate us yeah. on like different planets. Yeah. <sighs> I don't know, but but those the, the oh like Siri and stuff. I don't think they're actually as advanced as future. other AIs yeah, that are developed. You won't be here that long. That's what I was yeah, telling my coworker. Have you seen what? Um, at, and I don't even know how advanced that one is, but the little there's a little robot. I think it's called like Cosmo or something. You can buy it, and it, it'll recognize your face. It has face regu- recognition. It'll have like little emotions and stuff. <laughs> you can play with it. I already have something. It's called Tamagotchi. Tamagotchi. <laughs> I don't need that. Check. I have a robot. It's my wife. <laughs> she does what I program. Um, pretty soon, like in the future, because have you seen like you guys seen those real dolls, right? Those sex dolls that are mm-hmm. like fifteen grand or whatever. Man, they're so real looking, and then now they made it talk. So now I can talk to you while like you're so having now, sex with it. So now we're gonna have a throwback to the sex doll brothel episode. Yeah, and uh, now they're gonna talk to us. Now they're gonna talk to us, but and pretty soon, come on, they're gonna I be. Think we brought that up in that episode, actually. And they're gonna become. A, they're gonna become yeah. a whole another female. Exactly. Again. Yeah. Yeah. On rights, fuck that. Rip out that voice box now. And Take me dude, out. Break that shit. And Take you know what's gonna happen? I mean, fire it's, the guy who fucking brought that up as an idea. And then we're gonna have robot women in the conference room. Okay. <laughs> robot women rights? Yeah. Stupid. And then it's gonna get to the point where they can actually like do stuff like cook and clean and not just have sex. Like that, that are your partner. Well, that's good. And. I guess, but then it's gonna, <laughs> like it's gonna be like you're gonna walk down the street and you're gonna see a guy with his robot girlfriend and you're just gonna be like, like oh that that's normal. It's just, oh yeah, look that's Rob uh, with a uh, Tina. Like he ordered her off the internet yesterday. Pretty well, cool, who the right? Hell would order someone named Tina? Cause or uh, whatever a sexy name. Was that's not sexy. Alice or something. Alice. Alice. That's an ugly name. I said Alice. Some Black Mirror type of stuff. <laughs> exactly, like the episode. Man, that would be so cool. I would get so many chicks. Black man, like Black Mirror is episode? like totally dark though. Quizna? Every episode I mean, is dark. Um, <laughs> what is that? Black Mirror. Black Mirror. Uh, Netflix original show. Mm-hmm. Okay, you know what? No. My dad and my brother are actually watching that, and they're telling me I need to watch it. It's insane. Yeah, they said it's a trip. Ghost showed it, me. It just like every episode is just like uh. Like how a future technology will, but isn't would it go tied down to like yeah. one main, like main story? Oh yeah, apparently because oh, yeah. there's more uh, things to fear that, that's than AIs. That's huh? what it is, there's yeah. more things to fear than AIs. It. It's man, watch it. It's crazy. Well, AI, it's AI really, is like it's like a big crazy concept, but um, the, like these things sometimes the. It won't go like super crazy like that. It's just like I guess stuff you can consider like more subtle. Like there's one where like you can get a an implant and you can record every moment of your life, and it just That's shows like, all the negative stuff. That's you know real. like it, like every story thing is just like a negative. Um, it's not real. Oh, it's like hypothetical. <laughs> it show it's yeah. basically like the downfall of who we are. Yeah, it just we... shows like it always paints like a negative light on that. On um, us as human beings now. It paints like a negative light. Like wanting well, to cause, improve ourselves. Because yeah. the the thing is, like about that show, they're they're always gonna show you like the the dark side of it. Because mm-hmm. I'm it's pretty sure there's dark. there's you know there's I'm pretty sure if that word exists, there'll, there'll be like people that go on That's with their it. lives like you know with a positive effect. But it does show like how bad things That's, can be. That's good, kind of. It's like basically it's, it's kind of like having. Us. Oh yeah, I'm yeah, not saying yeah, that. Yeah, it's kind of like having a documentary come out. About how a company that we thought was good is actually bad, but beforehand. Yeah, kind of. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. Okay. that's pretty. But sick. some of the stuff is pretty like you'd be like, damn. Tell me, it looks It'd inevitable, cool. huh? Like, okay, You're like, like for that one where that. you can record your whole life, right? The dude, he's like has anger issues or whatever. But if he didn't have that, he would have never figured out because he pretty much he ends up slowly piecing that his uh. His wife was uh, cheating on him, and, but he goes crazy. He, he like, cause you can cast, you can cast like uh, a to moment the, in your life, like to, to a TV, TV, yeah. And everyone, you know, you can show people like your um, moment so of your life awesome. or whatever. Um, but yeah, he he's able to. <laughs> he ends up um, finding out that uh, she actually um, cheated on him, and he finds out that the I think their kid um, is not. I, I don't think it's his mm. in the end. So see, and if 
if he didn't have that, like, I know this story's, like, negative and all that, but if he didn't have that, he would have went on living his life the way it was. Wait, how did that happen? But see, and then this is, depends on your perspective perspective of like whatever the situation like he could have lived his life happy or whatever with her and whatever the baby but the thing i always like at least for me and the, like i just i don't want to live in a lie no matter what it is like, even if i'm super happy if it's a lie i don't like i'm yeah. living a lie like but yeah like, you guys watch it uh, it's a really it's good show of, for me the way i can explain it is like the show i have to brace myself for watching it like i have to mentally prepare before I watch it, because after I'm done watching it, I feel strange. I feel rocked. Like, have you ever seen Requiem for a Dream? No. It's like, after you watch that movie, you don't feel right. You just feel like, what the hell did I just watch? It gives watch? you that, uh... Eerie feeling? It's, it's depressing. Game of Thrones feeling, where it's just negative. <laughs> like, Is that how Game of Thrones I makes you feel? Like Game of Thrones. Really? Like, yeah. early on? I in the, fir- in the first season? What the I'm heck? I never... Sex. I wouldn't see Always that show. Have sex after really, episode. man. Game of like Thrones. season, Game of I think it was like the Game first, the first few like seasons or episodes. Like there's like certain like, it usually ended negative from what I remember, and it just made you feel like, like damn, what did I watch? Like it was so good, you wanted to keep on watching. Like, yeah, like, it's like you story, put like a new like, monster yeah. under your bed to be afraid of <laughs> in a way. Like you know, little kids are scared of monsters and shit. The closet darkness. You say it's new almost, new monster. Yeah, you put, like, something else to be afraid of um, when you watch, like, what something. is it, Black Mirror? Yeah. It's just like, God damn, that's lurking in the darkness. Like, that's in the future, possibly, any of this. Mm-hmm. And it's like... That's a good show. That's a pretty good show. Uh, All right, guys. Man. Let me shame this. Uh, oh, damn. Is there any more talk? you want to keep on going? Yeah, I was just going to say something. Go for it. Say go it. for it. Go for it. This <laughs> is the floor. The floor is yours. Just go for it. Hey, the floor is yours. Say anything you want. Speak your mind. Be free, my son. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> speak it, man. It's it's all yours. Go ahead. Are you got to talk like a king. Nah, I don't want to speak now. It's your peasants. Uh, uh, hey, go ahead, bro. Fucking MCF. What's up? No, nah, yeah. But, yeah, my train of thought did get thrown off. It's all right, man. You'll bring it back. That sounds like a good show, Train of Thought. <laughs> That's the sequel to Game of Thrones. And what were you going to say? No, my Train of Thought literally got thrown off. Way to go, man. It took the Amtrak out of here. <laughs> it took the, the passengers got off. Man, Those Amtrak's fucking expensive. Thoughts. I wanted to Amtrak. take <laughs> yeah, the Amtrak. Tight. I actually want to take one up to San Francisco. Uh I want to oh. take one of those fucking graffiti trains, like a hobo. Oh, I know. Like a stick and like a little, uh, a little bandana thing. that has an apple and a banana in it. <laughs> like, pitch it over my shoulder. That's not apple and banana. Is that oh, what whatever. you thought was in there? Well, isn't it like? It's, isn't no, it like a? Clothes. It's feces. Oh, That's, feces. Yeah. What do you think all the shit? I haven't, do, do you ever? Is see that like, to like ward away like, like, like dogs? animals and shit? Yeah. Or stop lying. This guy thought mm-hmm. that. Fucking hobos ate like fucking healthy vegans eating bananas and Not apples. hobos, but someone who's who's deciding Homeless? to live that life. Like right at the beginning, they have that little stick with the little bandana and they put like <laughs> grapes in it and apple. Grapes and, and apples and protein bars. Do you yeah. think you guys could jump on a train? Pre workout. Like me, myself, and Irene? Jump on a train. Or uh, off the uh, office. Uh, Michael tries to jump on yeah. a train. Yeah. It seems so cool. The only thing, because I've seen movies where like it doesn't go right and apparently it's real, the train like. Sucks it sucks you in, I guess. Yeah. Even though it's not going that fast, it, it sucks you in. If you fall, like if you fall, you're gonna fall under the tracks somehow. Yeah, and then I saw a movie where like a guy, a security guard's like chasing this kid, a uh, skateboarder kid. They jumped on the train, and then like they end up hitting him with a skateboard, and then the security guard like falls and like gets cut in half. And, like he's still alive and stuff. It's pretty crazy. If you check it out, it's called a uh, Paranoid Park. Skip. To hour one thirty, yes. I don't know the timestamp, but it's in there. It gets cut in half. Pretty yeah, I never thing. wanted to jump on a train ever. Never crossed my mind. You ne- I never. No, why mind? would you want to jump on a train? Who said that? One of you guys. Mm, I did. He didn't. Oh, oh I, I do. said that. I would want to jump on a train. Right. Yeah. Would you want to jump on a train? Yeah, all day. <laughs> <laughs> that seems cool, like the old old western movies. What? I mean, the train's nice. moving hella oh, slow. <laughs> what are you talking about? Like when you're riding a horse real fast. <laughs> no, 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 not that type of jumping on the train so when people will just like hitchhike on the trains. Like the doors, or whatever, they'll have the sliding doors open. And the train's moving hella slow. And you just like jump on. So you like And then when you trains? jump on, like, what do you do after that? Jump off? No, yeah, they use it to... 
to take them somewhere else. Jumping on a train. You like slow trains? You like fast trains? Fucking. <laughs> 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 Oh yeah, but that's like on my one of my bucket lists is to jump on a train. Oh, and have a, like a stick bandana thing. Now that you say <laughs> that, yeah. or like and then uh, jump like, put a knife in my mouth and jump into the ocean. That'd be cool. Like oh, why? Just because that's something what? cool. What do you mean? Like I want to do that before I die. Wait. Put a what? knife in my mouth and dump. D- dump? <laughs> I'm fucking dumping the ocean with a knife in my mouth. I want to jump in the ocean. With a knife in my mouth. Like, Where did you see like, that from? I, what do you mean? Like movies. What, what do you guys... Uh, like when the girl's caught underwater and he's like, all right, I'm going to save her. He puts the knife in his mouth. He goes... You know, he get, gets in and oh, cuts the rope and stuff. And he's all cool. <laughs> that's badass. That's tight. Uh, I want to do that. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. But you got to get like oh, oh, super much, like a damn. lot more muscles. Like, oh, also what I want to do too is like someone confronts me, like a gangbanger or something. Uh-huh. And I just go like, I go up to him like, don't do this. And then I like, peek back like my coat and I have my gun right there and then he just walks away. Oh, you want to do the little peek? Yeah. Let's <laughs> go like that. And I spit. That'd be tight. <laughs> it makes that sound. Well, you guys don't have anything like that you guys want to do before you die? Yeah, Bucket honestly. List? The Pacific Crest. I want to do that. What's that? Pacific Crest Trail. It's a, it's a hike you do. It goes from the Canadian border to the Mexican border. It goes through California, Oregon, and Washington. You're going to walk that whole thing? Yep, it takes three months. Three months? Oh! Three months of camping oh, yeah, and stuff. Right. Oh, camp. Oh, that, that yeah. um, running or jogging. Oh, hell no. There's, there's, there's people that try to do, like, like a, I guess, like a speed run of it. But speed run? That's pointless. I mean, it's not pointless. I mean, if it's something you want to do, but I feel like you're going to be more prone to injuring yourself. Is there animals out there that. that can kill you? Like, uh, mount- yeah, I guess mountain lions. Black bears. Fuck. No, you there, gotta there have some guns. On the sidelines, the you animals. Gotta, you gotta have some. Are they <laughs> they're they're like, not like, handing you water. <laughs> it, it, it's like a Snow White. Snow White. Bear. When you pass off, the animals bring you some of the uh, drink. And tell yeah, cool. they take you to a house with magical elves. Oh, <laughs> uh, so like, I'm assuming you gotta have some like M16s or something or some rifles, right? No, they stay they stay away from people. But I mean, I'm pretty sure people carry like fanny packs. Taser like, guns. Certain, Huh? Like mace and pepper spray? Yeah. Harp- yeah oh, bear like spray? Something. Have you guys seen bear spray? Yeah. It's like that big or something. You put it on your back and you spray it. Right? No. Well, the, I think the bear spray I seen is like a big old can. Oh, okay. I over-exaggerated that. then. But it's like that big. <laughs> yeah, a big like, old can. Like you said a big old can you put on your back? <laughs> yeah. That's what I thought. It was like a backpack and then you spray it. Honestly, one thing I want to do before I die is a, I want to buy a boat. And I want to like, like all of us like to be on the boat like in the lake. Oh, I just say, like yeah. chilling out. Ocean. Like, I oh, I, I have a gold chain on that too. Like, I want a gold chain. But a like, gold chain. I'm not one for like flashy jewelry, but I've always pictured like that scene with the chain on. That's something <laughs> I definitely want to do before I die. We all have different things. What about you, Armageddon? A thousand Fuck. fifteen push-ups. A thousand fifteen push. I don't know. There's all kinds of stuff, really. Everything, I guess. Hopefully a lot of shit. Well, I mean, like, one in particular that sticks... Mm, probably climbing a fucking tall-ass mountain. You know, I almost died one time. Like, or I wanted to do, uh... I wouldn't... I don't want to do that ever. Mountain like, climbing or something. Yeah. Okay. Something exhilarating. Something where I'm, I'm risking a shitload. I don't ever... I was, like, <laughs> yeah. 16. I was at the lake. I was climbing, like, the big-ass... You know, on the side of the mountains, basically? I'm climbing it, right? And it's all going good. When I try to pick myself up, I slip. I'm so I'm literally hanging my, my feet are dangling I'm on the edge and you know the edge where I'm like trying to pick myself up at it's only like this wide maybe about as wide as like this so it's like either I fall and I die or I just try to pick myself up so I, <sighs> I hoist myself up it was scary you did a pull up yeah I guess in a way rock climbing pull up yeah <laughs> that was the scariest thing in my life and I never ever ever tried to do that again never yeah I want to do that but I want to <laughs> do it with proper equipment Mm. Yeah, yeah, be smart about it. Pillows yeah. on the bottom and stuff. Yeah, trampoline. trampoline. <laughs> and trampoline. A big old giant like cream pie that I can just fall in. <laughs> the, clo- the closest I've gotten to that was. Uh, <laughs> That's exactly the cream pie. I went to wow. Yosemite one time, there. and by this lake, there's like this super steep cliff, but there's there's kind of grooves. Like if you're careful, um, you can kind of walk in the grooves on that steepness. That's the closest I ever got to like. Putting myself in a crazy situation like that. 
But oh. that I wasn't really worried because I'm I was I'm really confident in like the control that I have. Like, all right, I'm gonna put my like foot here and like I actually like examine like where I'm putting my foot. Like, um, like is it gonna be enough? Does it look slippery? I'll take you guys to the cabin soon. Out there, there's like this. Uh, it's just this big ass I like, guess side of the mountain because you're basically at the edge of the mountain. Huh. So you walk to it and it just goes like this and then just drops straight down. Man. And my brother and my cousin, they went down, they walked all the way down like to the river and like climbed it back up. I didn't do that because I was walking like halfway down and I started slipping. I was like, nah, because it, it's it's probably about maybe like a, a two three hundred foot drop. Mm. I don't I don't want to I don't want to die. Wait, it's a mm. was it a mountain or a hill? No, it's the side of a mountain. Because what's the difference between a hill and a melon? Hills have grass. Man, I don't, right? don't want to say like, something melons? and sound dumb. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, <laughs> we sound dumb plenty of fucking times. I, call it, I call it a mountain because it's just all rocks. It, it's all rocks. And like I said, it's all jagged and just drops straight down. I think a hill is more... It's like dirt, made of dirt? It's too? like half and half, maybe. Hmm, but it's sense. not all steep. Like an ant hill? They don't call it an I ant thought, mountain. I thought a mountain is when it breaks like a certain level of elevation. Uh, like it has to hit like a certain amount of oh, feet, yeah. and it's like well, either that's way, a fucking we're mountain. We're on the side of a mountain where you know we're way above sea uh, level. We're up in the mountains, so. Hey, yeah. hey, so how much do you think uh, it would cost to hike the Pacific Crest Trail? Uh, I know it's like eight grand. Eight grand. Probably. No, yeah, it's in the thousands. Thousands. How did you know that? Eight grand. Well, you didn't. It's between uh, five, two thousand and eight thousand. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan has yeah. he done it? No, he had somebody on who did it. Except they did it. They uh, they marathoned it, the entire thing. Wow. I forgot how many days it was. It might have been like oh, three. I I think but, I know what guy you're talking about. No, it was a girl. It was a girl. Yeah, and that's she got impossible. First place. She's the first one to do it. That's impossible. She's a female. She can't do that. <laughs> I know. She was the first one to do it, and literally, she would take like. 10 i think she only took maybe like a handful of 10 minute nap during those three those three days to the point where she, when she would wake up i think it was three days just fucking jamming yeah just jamming there's a it. there's a guy who could run that whole thing like non-stop there's, never there's no me. way she did the pacific crest in three days you gotta watch it i forgot i'll, I'll send it to you i forgot uh <laughs> the pacific what her name is. crest in three days running uh, though i don't know what it was i might be totally wrong <laughs> but she basically she marathon like there's a, there's other big days, trails. fucking days. Oh, it was multiple, yeah, multiple days. Yeah, she just kept going to the um, point where when she would fall asleep for 10 minutes, she would literally wake up in a rage because she was, like, mad at her husband. She was like, why did you let me sleep that long? He's like, he would just, like, point at his clock and he would, like, look at it and then look at her and he'd be like, you've only been asleep for 10 minutes. But she said that would, like, would just rejuvenize her. Like, she was just yeah. ready to go, like, 100% charge. Are you guys looking it up? I'm trying to find it. I can't find anything. I think you're lying. Man, I wish I knew her name. I put Pacific Crest Girl Marathon. No, not that. I don't think it was that. Oh, that's why I can't find it. Because I think the record for the Pacific Crest is like two months. There's and a guy. I don't think someone. W I don't think the human body is capable of running straight for two months. Yeah, there's a guy. That's what I was going to say. There's a guy on uh, Stan Lee's Humans. Have you guys remember oh, that? Oh, the he one. He could that run forever. Show. Well, I mean, I think he has no, to but stop he, yeah, uh, for a little bit to drink. Because uh, I've seen something on that. Even though he. He doesn't, fatigue? I think they explain it. Even though he doesn't pr produce the lactic acid mm -hmm. that makes you feel fatigued. That's you, a bad you, thing too, huh? Yeah, you need it yeah. because that that, te that you allows you to, that you need to stop. Yeah. Like it, lymph nodes. Because if he continues, he, he, his muscles will start tearing and his bones will start degrading. Yeah, he ran. It's, he, it's too much like shock on your bones. He's and, won and every yeah. single, that's like not fair. He's won every single crazy. Like, marathon. Pretty crazy. It's like a, what they say, because there's also syndromes, like, well, not syndromes, uh, disorders. Where people um, don't feel pain, and um, that that's like a really bad thing too, because you have no, you never develop a sense of uh, pain. yeah, like just to be like aware you of never awareness know why to stuff. Going wrong. Yeah, Courtney DeWalter. Okay. Is it the so, Pacific Crest? Uh, yeah, her. Okay, read it to us. Read it to us. Ah. Uh, Guest bio, Courtney DeWalter is an ultra marathon runner who recently won the Moab 240 race in Utah in under 58 hours. That was a race. Yeah, that. That's Moab. But she did it in 58 hours, nonstop. She beat the second place finisher by 10 hours, 20 <laughs> miles. She's only 32. How she got started in running and why she thinks she's better than the other. Uh, that's nothing. 
She's a yeah. fucking phenom. Dude, she's unexplainable. Like, she's, literally, her diet, her regimen is, is you would think it would be something fucking, like, uh, where it's, like, her whole life revolves around training and preparing herself for that and doing everything she can and researching and all that fucking bullshit mm-hmm. just to get that good. But she doesn't. She literally, she just lives a basic-ass fucking life where she drinks Bud Light and eats nachos. She literally said she eats nachos. Yeah, she has a defect. She's like that guy, then. She has like a defect. Not a defect, but like an abnormality. Whoa, she looks weird. She's an Elon Musk, but of like athletic proportions. Is she Australian? That's that's what she is. She's Elon Musk if he were a (laughs) fucking athlete. See, uh, because I know, see, there's a guy who did uh, the Pacific Crest heck of fast. The Pacific Crest. The Pacific Crest is 2,655 miles. And this guy, I think his last name is Anderson, he did it in 60 days, 17 hours, and 12 minutes. Hey, Daniel, would you smash it and like that button? Hell yeah. Look at that beef jerky red skin right there. I know. <laughs> she's cool. Dude, she's badass fuck, dude. She's awesome. All right, so what I found is... Fuck, she's so cool. Ronnie rice a <laughs> Uh-huh, who's that? This man rimmed for rimmed? 10 hours. <laughs> what the fuck? He hung on a basketball rim for 10 hours. <laughs> His arms were just stretching out. <laughs> Until he touched the ground. He started off with like four feet what, arms. What was his name? Ronnie that, Rice? Is that what r- uh, rimming means? Rimming? Yeah. yeah. Like you hang on a... You hang on a basketball court. Basketball court? Oh, uh, Ronnie Rice, Ronnie. Go to look him up. Look him up. Right, I'm going to add that in on YouTube and yeah. see how great yeah. Ronnie Rice Rooney is. Damn, how long has this been going on? Podcast. Right, like two hours? An this hour? This is a live stream, dude. I wish it was. Oh, oh my bad. Oh, I have a chat. Oh, 500 <laughs> subscribers! Wait, how long has it been going on, though? We are at an hour and 20 minutes. Should we call it quits? So, Whoa, really? We've been going that long? That's yeah. what she said. Hey, uh, uh, guy now. So I typed in Ronnie Rice Roney in YouTube and uh, Bobby Brown Roney pops up. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah. Okay, and then, and then, and then another one, 1998. No, that's the one I meant. Yeah, that one. Rice Aroni, the San Francisco yeah. treat. Yeah, look it up. What do you mean, look it up? Yeah, like watch it. Play it? Yeah. All right. He ruined for 10 hours. You guys are going to keep on going? Rice and like, I got to leave already. All right. Okay, yeah, we it. cut it, yeah. Yeah. All right, are we going to do any uh, outros? I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Da, da, da. Thanks for visiting the guy now, guys. All right, this is Armageddon. I'm out. This ghost. All my dinosaurs sound off. <laughs> All right, uh, never mind. All right, see you guys. This is, M- this is MCF. Peace.